right, we're learning more this morning about key pieces of evidence that Ross Harris's attorneys are trying to get tossed out of court. Harris, as you know, charged in the death of his 22-month-old son, Cooper. Police say he intentionally left his son in a hot car to die. Now, along with Mal's murder, Harris is also charged with sexting a minor. His attorney wants the sexting charges severed from the murder charges, and he wants those cases tried separately. They also want some electronics that were seized during the investigation to be excluded at trial. And new this morning, we asked local attorney Paige Pate whether he thinks Harris will be successful in suppressing some of the evidence. I think he'll be successful on the attempt to get the evidence, the good evidence back. I think he'll win that. I think some of the suppression motions he's filed, he hasn't put a lot of facts in them yet because we don't know a lot of the facts. Those could be successful. And I think his best argument on suppressing any statements would be the one between Harris and his wife. All right, there he's talking about comments that his wife Leanna made after his arrest, reportedly asking him if he's said too much. That conversation was reportedly meant to be private, but was recorded. Harris is due back in court on Monday, a hearing likely to be pushed back.